Sydney, Jimmy and Jack McCain on Wednesday night visited mourners who came to pay their respects to their late father, Senator John McCain. The Arizona Department of Public Safety said between 12,000 to 15,000 people filed through the Arizona State Capitol Rotunda to view McCain's casket. The public viewing came hours after an emotional, private ceremony at the Arizona State Capitol. The siblings, three of McCain's seven children, thanked people waiting in line. Honoring John McCain, the week of events celebrating the life of the late senator. People stood in line for hours in the Phoenix heat, carrying umbrellas and sipping cold water. The National Weather Service says the high in Phoenix was 104 degrees. The Phoenix Fire Department says 14 people have been treated for heat-related conditions while waiting to enter the state capitol, with a total of 21 people being treated, CBS Phoenix affiliate KPHO reports. The Arizona Department of Public Safety told KPHO two people were transported to the hospital. Earlier Wednesday, Jimmy and Jack McCain, dressed in formal military attire, accompanied their mother, Cindy, as they received McCain's body ahead of the formal ceremony. As the ceremony concluded, Cindy McCain laid her cheek upon the casket. His children filed up to the casket and touched it, including his daughter, Megan, who was weeping. A motorcade with McCain's casket leaves Thursday morning from the Arizona Capitol. Following a service at North Phoenix Baptist Church, McCain's casket will go to Phoenix Sky Harbor International Airport for a salute from the Arizona Air and Army National Guard. McCain's 106-year-old mother, Alberta, will be attending the services in Washington later this week. Starting Friday. McCain will lie in state at the U.S. Capitol in D.C. A formal ceremony will take place in the Capitol Rotunda to honor McCain's service to the nation. Following the morning ceremony, the public will be allowed to pay their respects for the remainder of the day. McCain, referred to as the conscience of the Senate called his time in office in the nation's capital the most important job I have had in my life. On Saturday, a national memorial service will take place at the Washington National Cathedral where family, friends, colleagues, and political leaders will attend and honor McCain's life. Presidents George W. Bush and Barack Obama, both former presidential campaign opponents to McCain, are slated to deliver eulogies.